The world of Assassin's Creed Origins is relatively large, meaning that travelling across it requires, in most cases, the use of a horse, a camel, or this monstrosity. So there I was, debating whether or not I should actually go ahead and make a top 5 grains of sand video because I was that bored, and this idea came to mind. Of course, the idea I'm talking about is a video dedicated to the top 5 mounts in Assassin's Creed Origins. Quick disclaimer, everything in this video is, in my opinion, if you disagree or have more to add, then do let me know down in the comments section. But truly, the excitement is killing me to talk about horses, so why don't we just get into this video. So in our number 5 spot, we have got Majesty, which is a rare camel that has a red saddle, and to be honest, the only reason it's here is it was a bit of like a dice roll, coin flip, whatever, but come on, it's better than this thing. So this particular spot could be filled with anything, really, but I do like the red saddle on this camel, so I suppose that's a plus. All in all, a rather humble little camel. Moving on, we have got the Apophis Hero, or however you pronounce that nonsense. Now, what makes me really, really like this camel is the fact that it is black. It looks cool. The black makes the camel look more streamlined than it is, and the saddle and the other accessories on the camel, such as those horns below its head, make this camel look super cool. The black also makes the camel look a little bit sinister, which adds to that deadly assassin vibe if you want to look for that. This camel comes with the Horus pack, which is actually a part of the Season Pass DLC content if you want to go ahead and get that. And I quite like the look of this one, he's a nice camel. Moving on from the Horus pack straight into the Roman Centurion pack, we have got Lucius the Roman Stallion, which is a legendary mount that you get in the Roman Centurion pack like I said. Now I'm not entirely sure why I use this horse so much, but I really like the simple look of it. It's not over the top beyond its saddle, the saddle looks nice, the horse is relatively standard looking and doesn't pop too much and therefore doesn't look out of place ever. I also approve of that Roman feel. So if you want a really nice looking but simple looking cleanish horse, then Lucius the Roman Stallion is the boy. In our number two spot we have got the Unicorn. I mean we had to put something silly a little bit ridiculous on this list and I mean that ugly bootleg chocobo really didn't pop to me. So yes, have a unicorn that has light coming from its hooves when it runs, which is rather rather cool, and also because this mount doesn't have a saddle, this one doesn't actually have any clipping on it from what I've seen. But my favourite thing to do with the unicorn is abuse it and use its target practice and kill it. Because I have an urge to crush dreams. What else could be in our number one spot but the legendary mount Fangs that you get through the deluxe pack, I do believe. Now, simplicity is nice and all, but this horse is slightly over the top. And that's what makes this horse stand out. Those, well, fangs on fangs make fangs have a distinctive look. And although clipping issues are quite common with this horse, in fact, I don't think you can mount it and not clip in some way. But because the horse looks so good, it's fairly forgivable. I tend to find myself switching between Lucius and Fangs quite often, but Fangs is definitely one of my top picks for mounts in the game. But there you have it everybody, thank you all for watching the top 5 mounts in Assassin's Creed Origins in my opinion, so if I didn't mention your favourite horse, please go to the comment section and tell me what your favourite horse or your favourite camel or your favourite monstrosity is as there are plenty more mounts than the ones that I mentioned, so I'm sure a lot of you will have favourite horses or camels that I didn't mention. Why, 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 did, why did I word it like that? It sounded a bit autistic, to be honest. But thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Be sure to go ahead, leave a like, subscribe, share. Let me know what you think down in the comments, and I'll see you all very soon with another video at some point.